All right, everybody. Happy Monday. How's everybody doing today? All right. Um, then get the little packets that go in there, but for hot chocolate. Uh, he's talking about the little Keurig pots for hot cocoa. All right. So Monday's focus is weekly home blessing. Do not open those. I need to see how many I need before I give you some. Um, One, two, three, four. Okay, so you're doing your eight items. Um, I actually, I did an update on somebody's flight plan this week, so I'm gonna throw that in there with this. So you've got your sheets, changing your sheets, uh, your windows and glass, your windows and mirrors. You've got dusting over things. For culling, you can also use it for filing. Okay, let's stop with the gushers. I'm not gonna eat them while I'm doing this. Vacuuming, trash, and mopping. So, with that being said, here we go into the self care. Remember, those are only eight minutes a piece using your timer to make sure you're only doing eight minutes a piece. So, self care. Did you get dressed to shoes, hair, and face? Don't forget to brush your teeth, wash your face, and all that wonderful good stuff in the morning because who likes morning breath? Did you eat all your meals, drink all your water, take all your meds? 15 minutes of loving movement. Are you pampering yourself? Get ready for bed. Wash your face, brush your teeth, mouthwash, floss, all that good stuff. And then go to bed at a decent hour. Especially with the time change that just happened, I know it can be kind of stressful for our bodies to actually get that sleep right now. So really try to be mindful of that. All right, you're cleaning, the only cleaning. We're not doing three hours worth of cleaning every day. We're doing our weekly home blessing, eight minutes. Make your bed, let's see, about four to seven minutes, depending upon how many fluffy pillows you got. Uh, swish and swipe, 90 seconds. Laundry, one full cycle. Actively, it should only take you 10 minutes inactively, like the wash machine and the dryer going. It's going to be about an hour and a half. Long, uh, dishes done throughout the day. Maybe you're doing 10 minutes each time. Maybe it's 15 for dinner. Shine your sink. That shouldn't take you nothing but two minutes. Hot spot. Uh, you've got three of them, two minutes each. So that's six minutes. Room rescues. You've got three of them, five minutes each. So that's 15. And then your mission for today, take 10 minutes to shine the base, back, sides, and stuff, you know, the yucky parts of your toilet, the stuff that we don't get for the uh, swish and swipe, and then take five minutes to go to your stash and dash areas and pick up all the trash, or as much as you can in five minutes, all right? Your planning. Let's check that AM calendar. What appointments do we have today? What events do we have going on today? What is for dinner today? And what goals did I set for myself today? And are those still going to be worked out? Your PM calendar. What appointments do you have tomorrow? What events do you have going on tomorrow? What's for dinner tomorrow? Do you need to plan anything, prep anything, pull anything, pick up anything? What three goals do you want to try and accomplish tomorrow? Set up your launch pad, including your purse, your keys, your wallet, your planner, uh, getting lunches made, and anything else that you need to have in one central location to walk out the door or to start your day at home. Don't forget to also lay out your clothes. So for those of you without kids, I will talk to you tomorrow. Remember, be happy, be healthy, be here, and be you. Don't forget, if you want to make sure you get my videos every single day, hit that little bell and they will come to you. All right. For the kids, did they get up and get dressed today? Wash your face, brush your teeth, all that good stuff. Did they eat all their meals, drink all their water, take all their meds? 
Did they get ready for bed at a decent hour, washing their face, brushing their teeth, flossing, mouthwash, all that good stuff, and then go to bed at a decent hour? Their cleaning, did they make their bed? Did they do their one zone, uh, their bedroom zone? And did they get their chores done? Remember, we should not be making them work any longer than the minute that their age is. So Jacek is eight. He spends eight minutes cleaning. Just like if he would decide not to behave, he would spend eight minutes in time out. Which on a parental note, timeouts don't work for him. I need to do a reverse timeout. All right. Uh, their planning is schoolwork done, checked off in their backpack, ready to go. Launch pads set up by them, checked by us, and clothes laid out, ready to go. There you go. That is Monday. I will talk to you with a brand new video on Tuesday. Be happy, be healthy, be here, and be you.